Welcome. You are now viewing a video tutorial on how to jailbreak your iOS device running 5.1. Please note, the jailbreak is only available for every device but the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2nd generation and 3rd generation. Also note, at the time this video was made, this jailbreak is semi-tethered meaning after your device powers off, some features may not be available to be used until after the device is connected to the computer again. Please refer to the video description for any updates. After getting that out of the way, let's start the video. The first step is to download Red Snow in the video description. Mac and PC download links are provided. The second step is to open up Red Snow. If you're on PC, make sure to right click the icon and run as an administrator. After you open it, click on Jailbreak. And then you'll need to connect your device to your computer. After you connect your device, hold down the power button and slide to power off. After your device has powered off, click Next on the Red Snow window and be prepared to follow the on-screen instructions. First, you'll need to hold down the power button for 3 seconds, then the Home and power button for 10 more seconds. And then finally, you'll release the power button and hold down the Home button for a, lo a little longer until something comes up on the screen. After it, it starts exploiting, you can let go and put your device down. Options should appear on the computer shortly after. Make sure Install Cydia is checked. You may install, you may check other options if you feel the need to do so. After that, click Next and wait for the process to complete on your phone. You'll see some text, just leave it alone. After your device has booted up, you can go ahead and see that a white Cydia icon has been added, but if you try to open it, it will simply crash. What you, needed to, what you need to do is go back into Red Snow. Once again, if you're on Windows, make sure to right click and run as an administrator. Click Extras, and you'll see an option to click Just Boot. Once again, you'll need to turn your phone off and follow the instructions to put your iPhone or iPod or iPad into DFU mode. After your device boots up for the second time, go ahead and navigate to the Cydia icon on your home screen. And once it opens, let it prepare. Make sure you're connected to a, a Wi-Fi network. After your device restarts for the second time, go ahead to slide to unlock, make sure you're connected to a network, and click on Cydia and let it prepare the file system. It should close automatically, then quickly navigate right back to Cydia and let it load again. 
If it prompts you to select a user type, just click user and then click continue. We're almost done. Now you'll need to click on manage, sources, edit, add, and you'll need to type in the big boss dot org slash semi tether and click add source. Return to Cydia, click search in the bottom right, and you're going to need to type in semi tether. You should see it right there. Click on it. Click on install and click on confirm. You now have a semi-tethered jailbroken device on 5.1. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe for future updates. If you need any help, please leave a comment below. Thanks again for watching.